bartender in New York City. I left my home in New Jersey because I knew there would be more opportunity for me in the big city. She is following her dream and she's happy doing it. When I'm not singing or bartending, I love to do yoga. I actually was in the process of getting my yoga teaching certification when I had to come out here. Hands into prayer, reaching up, down into forward bend, Uttanasana. Unfortunately, I had to come out to LA right in the middle of my certification course and I was not able to graduate. I had to choose. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime. There's no way that I would ever pass this up. Reach your left leg back. My parents have been out here for both shows. You lit it up, honey. You lit it up. God. I told you. Feels really nice having them there. I don't think either of them would miss it for the world. It's just been so great. I'm not alone. I can't express how proud we are of, of our little girl. in the end there. Luda. This was the first time that I, it took me so long to vote yes, and I just wanna, I want to explain yeah, it why. It took you all a really long time to <laughs> no, vote. No, it really did. It yeah. really did. I feel like it started off very slow, like the first half of the song was slow, and I feel like you got into it towards the end. So I feel like, you know, maybe it was a little bit of the nerves. I don't know if some of the, you know, the first part was a little contrived, but I love your voice so much, and I feel like it's so unique. <laughs> but, yeah. It absolutely is. But I was on the, I was on the fence, and, that, and that's what it pulled me over towards the end of why I voted yes as opposed to voting no. So I want you to work on that yeah. in terms of giving it more stage presence and just giving it your all like you did towards the end of the song. Yeah. Cool. Good advice. Speaking of on the fence, Kesha. I know. I waited till the last second. You did. I love your voice. I don't love your voice singing that song. Right. I don't think that was the right song choice. It's been a couple of those tonight. Okay. But 
I voted yes because I know your potential and because in the future you're going to pick the right song. Yeah. Okay. Right. All right. Right. A and R. <laughs> you're saying right. Do you agree with that? I totally agree. Uh, first of all, I want to be honest and say you might be my favorite voice wow. in the entire competition. <laughs> But, how's that for non-committal? But, <laughs> the thing about it is, there are songs we do in our shows that are sort of like fun and they work and they get you to the next one and then there's the money. And this wasn't the money for you. And you gotta bring the money. Yeah. It's not like Jerry Maguire. You need to do that every week. Yeah, show me the money. Until we get to the end. And, and I think this was the wrong, you know, like Pamela from West Virginia wrote, bad song for her. That's all she wrote. Yeah, yeah. yeah, bad song for her, which is is a good way to put it. It's, there's better ones for you. It's all right. You can do that in your live show. But you, ra you raised the wall. Yeah, you raised the wall. Only money songs in the show. Only money, money songs. songs. All right. Show all right. me the money. Bottom line is you raised the wall, which means you right. beat Macy Kate in the hot seat. And Macy Kate, we have to say Ooh. goodnight to you. Give her a big round of applause as we send you off. Thank you so much for being here. Our Instagram winner. Dana Williams, if we look at the leaderboard, that means you are now in the hot seat.